I was probably the last person chosen to go to Central High School. Um, people stepped forward and signed a list saying that they were interested in going. This was spring 1957, and we knew that Central was to be desegregated the following fall. I approached the soldiers three times, and each time when I was turned away, I thought, this is not the place I'm supposed to start to school. So when I got down to the center, and the soldier this time directed me across the street where there were angry demonstrators, that's when I finally understood that they were there to keep me out of school, not to protect me. When I stepped out into the street, the crowd surged forward and they were immediately behind me. I couldn't go back in the direction I had come from. There were reporters and photographers in front of me walking backwards, asking me questions. I didn't say anything because I was afraid that if I opened my mouth, I would cry. There are several things that keep repeating itself that assure me that we can never have real reconciliation until we honestly acknowledge our painful but shared past.